welcome to Bali. This is the hotel gym that I have been using so far. Uh, we're about four days into my stay and today I'm going to be transferring to another hotel. These first few days have just been about, like I said, getting myself in a, in a nice mental headspace. Uh, you know, weed free for four days and it feels good. So with that said, uh, I'm going to get into a workout. I've only hit one workout since I've been here, so that's not ideal. Um, I've had a few drinks. Last night I decided not to go out after thinking the whole entire day I was going to have a massive night out on the piss. And I'm so glad I did because I've gone downstairs, I've got breakfast, I've had a coffee, and now I'm going to hit a workout. So we're going to do some triceps and some biceps. So uh, it's, it's extremely limited as to... <laughs> As to what I've got here, we've got dumbbells up to about 20 kilos. Uh, we've got a, a, a weight station, but it is, it's a pretty decent one. I had a good ch uh, chest workout on this. We've got some uh, cross, uh, what do you call it, pec deck, and a bench press, which I was able to change up from a flat press to an incline press, which I then superseded with uh, push-ups. So that was a good workout. What am I going to do with this beard, man? What the fuck am I going to do with this? It's definitely getting long. So is the hair. For breakfast, I had a full English breakfast, uh, which was nice, and I had three extra eggs. And also, I had two berry smoothies, and I had two cups of coffee. So definitely feeling like I've got enough energy to hit a good workout. Sitting at around about 98 kilos, and I've maintained that for probably the last week and a half. So we're not really going up. I haven't been counting calories at all, as you guys know. Uh, once I get back to Alice Springs, I'll be, you know, I'll be back into the, the swing of things. Um, what the fuck? I think we just had a power cut. Anyways, I'm gonna chuck on MTV, and um, after that, what's this guy? Coming in, bruh? No, nah, he's not coming in. Chuck on some MTV, nice and loud, get some water in me, and I'm gonna crack into this workout. And following that, we're gonna be transferring to Kuta Beach, because right now I'm actually at Seminyak, um, which is a, a bit, bit more of a quieter sort of place. Kuta Beach is, is hustle and bustle. I'm gonna spend two nights there, and then I'm gonna go to Ubud, which is the nice, uh, you know, relaxing sort of spiritual sort of place um, around here which is away from the hustle and bustle so if I'm gonna go out drinking I'll do it tonight because I will be in Kuta and uh, following that that'll be my last night drinking I've had two I've had a lot of alcohol these last few weeks well not a huge amount but definitely more than I'm used to and so I'm ready to get back on that clean clean diet clean uh, clean life because you feel good for it man you feel good for it so let's go Alright guys, apologies, no footage, uh, someone came into the gym and um, I started talking with them and then it was like, nah, this is going to be too awkward. So anyways, we're back at the hotel, I thought I'd just give you a quick look at the room, because it's pretty fucking sick, although it is quite uh, messy, but uh, I'm about to check out so that doesn't matter. This is a deluxe room, so first thing over here is the bathroom area, which is all like concrete slab, which is actually really cool because it's got these frosted glass windows. So. We've got a massive shower, bathtub, which I haven't touched, and then when you pull these across, we've got the vanity and a big mirror here. What do we got? TV, and uh, we've got an absolutely monstrous bed. It's about, I think it's a super king or something, so it's like, it's actually wider than it is long, so yes. And then we have a balcony, which I haven't really used too much. Oh fuck, what am I doing? Um, 
this way. And it's pretty cool. It's like a little village sort of thing. So you've got all your rooms, all the levels, five, four, three, two, and one. And they're all surrounding this pool area, um, which I haven't really used either, but that's beside the point. So right now, it's about 12 o'clock. I got a late checkout at two, which is good. So I'm gonna pack up my shit, and then I'm gonna go down the road and get some lunch, and uh, which is my post-workout meal. And that should be good. Some sick lighting in here too, I must say. Fucking decent. Like I said, you know, I haven't done any vlogging. I, I, I could have showed you some pretty sweet, sweet stuff by now, but oh well, it doesn't matter. You guys are following along anyway, so I'll see you guys at the restaurant. I have been told about a, uh, it's called Cafe Organic, and it's about two minutes down the road, and apparently they offer nice clean meals. I think my mindset's changed a little bit, you know, I was eating so much crap while I was in New Zealand and stuff, but uh, I just want clean foods now, so that's what I'm going to go and get, hopefully a nice protein and carb source, not too high in fat, and I'll show you what I get. You guys got to see this lift, it's sort of like a funky place, well, this, I've never seen a lift like this, it's like a fucking spaceship. All these neon lights, which is pretty buzzy at night. But obviously it's daytime right now, but hopefully, hopefully you get the gist. I'm pretty sure my room is that one. As you can see, it's um, it's kind of like a fucking spaceship in here. It's semicircle shaped. And it's got all these windows, and all these guys can see what I'm doing right now, so hopefully they're not thinking I'm trying to film them, which I'm absolutely not. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty, pretty out of it, really. And here we are, guys, on the streets of Bali, extremely similar to Thailand. <laughs> Massage. Let's see if I can't find this place. You get hit up for so much shit when you, ride, when you walk along the streets that it's just, it gets to the point where you just absolutely got to ignore it. You just, you're like, just too many people. You just got to keep walking. And it'll only take you a few hours to be able to do that and not feel bad because they do it to every single motherfucker that walks past well, I'm a coffee lover Everybody, what is happening? We're here at the uh, second um, location of my trip to Bali, and <laughs> it's a little bit smaller and uh, a bit shittier than the other one. But really, I can't complain because it's costing me 
a grand total of about $25 Australian per night. And you know, you got a TV, you got a double bed, you got Wi Fi, I've got free breakfast. Honestly, you can't go wrong. The, the bathroom, I'm not even going to show you because it's, um, yeah, it's definitely nothing like the other one. But get something to eat, and then I'm going to come back here and I'm going to have a few drinks by myself. That's all right. Um, I've met I've met a few people since I've been here. I uh, haven't I've been out once, which was okay. Uh, but tonight I'm going to go to the fucking <laughs> the yeah the top place here, which is Sky Garden. Um, they've got a DJ every night, resident DJ, as well as other acts that come to town. But as far as like EDM EDM music and raving and shit, they've got a massive hall. I think what they call it a sky, the Sky Dome, I think. And um, a massive stage, it's, it's fucking epic. Like, if, you ever, if you're ever in a fucking good mood and you want to go dance, go there. Um, they've got four levels. I think the Sky Dome's on, like, level two. And then you've got level three, which is, I don't know what it is, and level four, which is, like, a rooftop um, bar. So I'll, uh, I'll make sure I've got some battery so I can show you guys. But uh, I most probably will be getting drunk tonight. But then that'll be it. That's fucking it, man. I'm not drinking anymore for the entire holiday. If I don't have a good night tonight, well, what can you do? But I think I am going to. But for now, we're going to go do this washing, get something to eat, and I'll see you guys later. So, quick tour, guys. This is the pool. And um, once again, like we've got the rooms surrounding the pool. I think mine is just up there. And uh, it's actually, it's, it's quiet season in Bali at the moment. So I think it picks up late December before Christmas and New Year's. Laundry. This way? Okay, cool. So it turns out they do laundry here. Um, at the other place, for example, you'd pay, oh, fucking anywhere from a dollar fifty to two bucks per item here it's 20 cents so I'm gonna do it here the only reason I didn't do it until now is because the other place was too expensive so I'll get it done here which will be nice and easy yeah so when will it be ready tomorrow yeah okay yeah that's fine yeah wait thank god I don't have to lug that around now we're going to go get something to eat. You want to see, you want to see this laneway that this car went down. Looking on the map, well, on Google Maps, the road actually stops about here because from here onwards, it's, uh, it's fucking tight. I don't know how the hell he got me down here actually. The pub. Can't go wrong with that, right? Open? Yes. I'm in and get something to eat. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. All the way up. All the way up.